All right, folks, I just wanted to go over the outline and um, show you what's going on. And while, while I talk, we'll uh, show you a little something. While we built this, we added materials along the way, okay? And so right now, we're going to watch this thing render, and I'm going to show you an outline. And again, any feedback would be fantastic, good, bad, indifferent. Um, let me know, but um, uh, renderings coming out that red plastic looks fantastic. Almost too much, um, uh, um, but one of the things we didn't talk about is if you look at the two front edges, those are called fillet setback curves and uh, or setback fillets, and the front two radiuses are just that. They are three edges that come to a point and they're all just filleted at, a, I don't know, um, point uh, three hundred thousandths. Um, but you look at those two front edges and you know they give you some pop, especially if you're designing a consumer product. You certainly want, um, when you go to rendering, you want that shine or the sheen in so what you do is you if you look on any consumer product you're gonna see a radius and that radius is very tiny it could be twenty thousandths of an inch fifty thousandths of an inch a standard circuit board is um, sixty thousandths or sixty five thousandths of an inch um, I'm looking at an iPod docking station right now and surprisingly this particular um, dock has it looks like the outer edge is zero radius no radius at all but the the inner edges um, have a bit of an edge and that catches light makes things look nice and you can see that in this rendering <coughs> so right now I'm gonna just jump over to um, to word and show you this is the the outline um, that I that I'm following so right now we're We've just completed chapter four. The next is uh, creating product production drawings. So we're gonna we're gonna create production drawings of this guy and dimension it. And you know if you follow along and you're working at it, and this can actually be made. Right now, this is uh, our target is it's a consumer product and it's made of a hundred thousandths of an inch ABS plastic. It's comprised of two components. The blue is the base, and the white is the top. And so, if you were to go to a factory, you'd you'd be giving them actually everything. We'll show you what the whole breakdown ends up being. And uh, you know, you follow along. Yeah, this can actually be manufactured. Would I take this to manufacturing? No. There's a lot of stuff that I do. Um, when I'm dealing with a factory but this is the easiest way to convey the message and learn SolidWorks in the quickest manner so I hope you enjoyed this chapter and let me know what you think and join me for the next half a dozen chapters thanks for watching